So welcome back to Real Talk. Today I want to share just one more, um, <laughs> just one more. Today I want to share another group discussion activity. This one's called Choose Your Destination. It's really easy to implement. All you have to do is go to unsplash.com. This is where you can get beautiful images for free. You just thank the artist. It's very simple. And type in vacation spots or type in destinations. And you will get all kinds of cool images, much like the ones you see on the screen right now. Choose. I like to choose four. If you choose four, then everyone can kind of find one. If you get more than four, you sometimes will have just one person at a destination. So I like to choose four destinations. I post them around the room. And what I do is pose a question. You can use a question from the book study information above, or maybe you've just taught a lesson and you want to know like, what are your kids thinking? What are they feeling? How are they, how are they going to act on this thing that they just learned? And you can ask a question just like that. You know, after reading this section of the book, how are you feeling? Which image best describes your feelings and why? And then they go to that image. They don't get to speak, but they know the question. They know the images around the room. They go to that image, and once they are there, they group into twos. So if you have an image that has one student, you might have to be their partner. They need to group into twos, and I usually set a visual timer of about two or three minutes that I would like them to share. Each person needs to have their opportunities to share within that three minutes. So they share why they chose that image and, and link it back to the learning whatever it is that they're tying it back to. And then after everyone has responded, then they have a seat. However, if there's a big group there, they can switch and have a different partner and share their same answer with another partner until I call time. So if there's extra time, I think that's a great idea, is just find a new partner within your group, within your destination, and share your idea of why you chose that image and allow them to share as well until the time is up and then we're going to go back to our seats or we're just going to have a seat. Um, this is a really cool way to, it's much like picture perfect if you've tried that strategy. However, this way you have the question and you know the images and you get to choose your images based off of the question. I like this one because it gets learners up and moving around and it's also a way to just attach their learning to something abstract. It helps them to use their words to describe what they're thinking and why. So if you try, choose your destination, please do let me know and share your destinations. I think it'd be cool if we each share our destinations out with the world because you guys might choose something totally different than what I chose. So super excited to see the pictures out on Twitter to see or hear the comments below and let me know if you have any questions. Thank you for joining Real Talk. Choose your destination.